my brothers and sisters in Christ. As always, I hope this midweek message finds you and your families happy, healthy, holy, and wise. As you can tell, or maybe not from the background, I'm actually recording from the airport this week. Uh, I know I was not able to be with you for the, the great celebration of, of Sacred Heart this weekend as I was attending the ordination of a, a longtime priest friend, now priest friend, and uh, continue the travels. I'm in transit now to the next stage, which is taking a, a week of vacation. Uh, but nonetheless, even though we've hit the summer months, uh, so the, the calendar finally starts slowing down a little bit, there are still some important things going on in the life of the parish and ways for you to engage with your stewardship. So first of all, in recap, uh, I heard there was wonderful turnout for the, the celebration of our paternal feast day on Friday night for the Mass of the Sacred Heart and the reception afterwards. Grateful to Father Stephen for celebrating that in my absence and glad to hear so many of you turned out. But there, as I shared, that, that kind of always caps the, the liturgical season post-Easter as we get to these summer weekends of ordinary time. But some events that are still coming up. First of all, we have our big baby shower this weekend. You've been hearing about that from us, uh, shared extensively in last week's update. And so it's still not too late to go online to help sponsor a mom, a family in need. And there are volunteer opportunities, both for the shower itself on Saturday and prep opportunities uh, in the, the couple days leading up to it. So please go to the Rector's Corner on our website if you want to find out more on how you can help out financially or through volunteering for this weekend's baby shower as we continue to walk with moms in need. That uh, We'll also have a EMHC training Saturday morning at 9.30 a.m. in the church. Uh, you can reach out to, to Deacon Joe Millhouse uh, to let him know you're coming or, or show up, but an opportunity if you've ever felt called uh, to help, you know, distribute the body and blood of our Lord at, at Mass. It's a very sacred ministry. We will have food distribution for the month coming up on Saturday, June 22nd. As usual, there are no ID checks. Uh, this the, the queue will start up over by the Chancery Building on Jefferson Street. The ability to come through, no income checks, no ID checks, just food, uh, fresh food distribution for you or anyone else you know that might be in need. And then finally, in these summer months, we remind everyone that you've had the opportunity to see in the life of the parish uh, the great gift of those coming into the church at the Easter Vigil throughout the season of Easter. And so if you or anyone you know has considered becoming Catholic or just simply wants to is open and wants to learn more about the possibility of becoming Catholic, this is a reminder that our RCIA signups for the upcoming year are ongoing. Uh, you can go to the, the website uh, and find it through the, the various menus, or you can go straight to sacredhearthouston.org slash RCIA. So, nonetheless, while the events slow down in the summer months, there's lots of ways to continue to engage with your faith, and especially ways to continue to give back, especially to those most in need. In the meanwhile, in these months, while everyone is, is doing more travel, stay safe, stay cool, and I look forward to seeing you all soon. O sacred heart of Jesus, we place all our trust in you. Amen.